Hey everybody, it's Party Elite, and I'm about to kick off my coverage of Phoenix Point with this video right here, right now. If you don't know what Phoenix Point is, you're about to find out, of course, but think of it as XCOM Plus. So it's a turn-based strategy tactical game where you lead a squad against aliens. The game is literally being advertised as from the creators of XCOM, but you'll see as we play just how it differentiates itself from what is beginning to feel like a crowded market, to be perfectly honest. Um, the backer builds are available to anybody that's backed, like I did, and so full disclosure, I did not receive this game for free, it's not from the publishers or producers or developers or anything, I backed the game and that's why I've got access to, uh, to the backer builds. If you'd like the backer builds, then you can actually check out the link down below in the description and you can buy in and have access to the game as well. And they're actually releasing a new build every two months. I think that's the plan right now. As you can see, they are pre-alpha builds, of course. They're very early in development. It's every two months they'll release, potentially, until release of the full game a year from now. So there's a long way to go. Keep that in mind as you're watching. Uh, I'm excited to actually cover at least the, each backer build once. So once every two months at the minimum. But if you guys want to see more of this game, let me know with a comment down below. And I will spend some more time messing around with... Uh, with this game and exploring it. They've got some interesting lore happening. They've got some uh, you know, developer blogs every so often. So there's some cool stuff going on and some very interesting stuff as well that we'll dive into. Uh, so I'm actually going to play a random map. Uh, Fort Freiheit here is a fixed map scenario as the game so eloquently puts it. So there's probably plenty of other people that have already done it. Uh, it's consistent. It's sort of predictable. And while this is my first foray into the second build, I have played the first build. So, you know, I'd, I'd like to make things fresh for me as well, so there's some surprises in there for me too. So we're going to dive in to a randomly generated map and uh, kick things off. All right. So, again, if you're not familiar with these kinds of games, you will become quite familiar fairly soon. Uh, you've got a small squad, you lead them around, you take cover, you open shots, you take shots, you die often because these games are punishing, and, and I will tell you, this game is punishing just like XCOM is. So, first things first, first difference between this and XCOM 2 at least is the free camera. I love the fact that this exists. You are not just stuck into quarter angles, you can rotate the camera as you please. Thank you very much, developers. Now, uh, this second backer build has actually introduced a new character class. And that is this, uh, I guess it's an engineer, I forget the exact name, I'm sorry. But this person here, uh, Irina Petieva, who is currently in, uh, well, it's her turn right now. She's an engineer, I guess, is the best interpretation of this class. Uh, repairs, can put down turrets, things like that, is a bit of a support class, I guess. Um, again, these things are all in development still, so some things I'm sure are going to change as time goes on. Uh, take everything with a grain of salt. Now. We're actually going to move our sniper here first, Daniel Stoller. Let's get you moving. Well, let's swap into your pistol first. And that, again, weapon swapping on the fly, changing how many movement points it takes to do various things. But let's move you in to... Oh, dear, where is the safe space? Let's pull you up to here, just in case something is waiting for us over here. Now let's move on up. And again, as we move forward and as we uh, uncover more of the differences between this and the XCOM games and things like that, I'll point them out. There's some really cool features that they're implementing. For example, actually, we just stumbled across one. Uh, these are little crates. Uh, and these crates carry various items. And they carry items because you can run out of equipment. You can run out of ammo. You can run out of grenades, things like that. And you can pick up more. You can change your weapons. And depending on your character's class, you will or will not be able to use said weapon. So cool. Already something interesting. Now, since we are here, I don't think I'm able to fire with this. We've used too many action points with our movement. But we are able to fire with our pistol here. And in comes the second difference between this and... XCOM, and I love this. I love this. Check this out. Check this out. Not you. We're going to fire on you. If I click again, and if I scroll up, I can zoom in and pick where I want to fire. Now, we're pretty far off, so we're not very accurate, which is unfortunate, but the yellow circle is where 50% of our shots are going to land, and the red circle is where 100% of our shots are going to land, and we can choose where we want to hit. And these aliens have features like guns or shields or carapaces with armor of varying degrees and so you'll want to pick and choose where you hit and destroying a piece destroying a part as you can see disable effect will have various um effects on the enemy as well so pretty cool actually let's see if we have a better chance of hitting this one nope <laughs> no we do not so we're gonna hope for the best here and fire on you and let's see if we can pull anything off i do have to keep in mind my ammo but uh yeah, let's try it. Let's pop a shot. Let's get our first shot in there. 
bang. Oh, what do you know? We actually got some damage in there. And I think we destroyed the cover it was hiding behind as well. So that's cool. And also, let's take a minute to appreciate the music. How good is that music? So good. All right, let's, um, this guy doesn't really have that much of a move range, unfortunately, though he does have a jet pack. Uh, let's move you up to, hmm, here. I think this guy's got a gun, this, uh, this crab man over here. Where'd he go? Where'd he go? You've got a gun. You do not have a gun, it looks like. You do have a gun, yeah, that's definitely a gun. No shield on that one, though, so that's good to know. And I think that one's able to see us from where we're about to go. So let's pop in over here, get the cover, the half cover, use our extra movement. Again, if you stay within the blue uh, movement range, then you get an action after the fact. But if you move past it, you're dashing. Uh, I'm always dashing. But you're dashing, and that will actually reduce, uh, will make you unable to pull off all your actions. You won't be able to shoot, for example. Uh, let's see, do we move you up to here? No, we need to be very careful. Again, this game is very punishing. These games tend to be punishing. This one is uh, no different. Uh, maybe we pop in over here. We'll be able to shoot from here. Or over here as well. Maybe get us a better angle. Oh my god, we are surrounded, are we? There's another one here, and this one does not seem to have a gun. It's alright. It's, it's okay if we're exposed that way. In which case, let us actually get in over here. Move, move, move. There we go. And let's try to open shots in. Oh, we're probably way too far to be effective. Yeah, we're not going to do anything from this distance. Kind of want to save my ammo. And instead, what we'll do then is uh, use our special ability with this class and put down a turret. Let's put it down over here so it's able to fire in all directions. I don't know if it'll be able to fire from behind cover. You know what? Worth a shot. One way to find out. It'll increase its survivability. Hopefully, it'll get some work done. And now let's... Uh, Put you in an overwatch. Overwatch means if any enemy unit gets within our, our firing range and sight, we'll, we'll be able to get shots in as it's moving, so we can get some damage done first. Let's pull you over here. Foolish move here, putting my sniper all the way up front. That's not going to help. Okay, that's another crate. I was worried we just found another enemy. All right, let's see if we can get some hits in over here. Better hit chances. Uh, let's aim for the leg here. You can see, again, we'll reduce its movement range if we take its legs out. So, again, the parts that you fire upon actually matter. Uh, oh, breaking this one actually drops it by nine. Interesting. Well, let's fire in over here. Again, there's a spread, so hopefully we'll get lucky and uh, at least take one of these legs out. Come on. Come on. Nice. Leg disabled. One bleed. That means it's going to slowly bleed out. One hit point per turn with bleeding. And now it's their turn, and let's see what they do. Let's see what they do. All right. I want to come down over here, so let's keep an eye on this side. Make sure we move this way. We've got a gunner. We've got this one up on the roof that looked like it was melee only. And this one is melee only. I'm dropping its shield. That's fine. I'll let that one bleed to death. I'm going to fall back to that uh, bottom left corner. Oh, there's that Overwatch coming in as this thing was pushing towards us. Fair enough, that one's a melee crab, so that's not a problem. Now, I will also say, as we are uh, pushing through this playthrough, something that's really interesting with these uh, with the enemy is the fact that they actually... I'm trying to spot all of our enemies here. They actually evolve as uh, the game goes on. Now, I don't know if that's for... I mean, actually, I, I'm pretty sure that's not during the course of a single mission, but over the course of the campaign, you'll actually see enemies evolve over time and develop new abilities. And, uh, you know, like, for example, right now they have shields and maybe they're unarmored in certain parts, or maybe they're more likely to carry a weapon of a different type based on how you've been behaving. So that's a really cool proposition. I like games that evolve with you. Uh, hopefully there's some room for emergent gameplay there, but uh, yeah, pretty neat. Pop you on Overwatch here. There's not much else we can do. Let's pull you back. You can move pretty far. So I think we'll actually move you all the way up to here. And hope to get some shots in. So yeah, let's do that. Let's go up to here. Fire away to the side. Maybe get some damage done. And this guy can actually, or I should say this girl, Irina, can actually fight in melee as well thanks to those little claws she's got on her back. But we're obviously not in melee range right now. We are going to try to fire away. Come on, what do we hit here? What do we hit? We try to take care of its pincer. Do we pop shots at its head? Let's try it. Let's try it at the head. Again, less armor. The flashing striped red lights mean um, 
possible damage, whereas a full flash without the stripes, just like a complete white flash, means it's uh, it's definite damage. Or it's likely damage. It's more likely. You can still miss, obviously. I could take a leg out. Let's try... Let's try for the leg. Come on. Here we go. Ah, damn it. Just short. Fair enough, fair enough. That's okay. Now, we can fire with you as well. Do we want to try and take this guy out? He's just going to bleed out, so let's leave it for that. And here, actually, let's swap. I'm not going to use my pistol at this range. Let's swap over to our sniper rifle and use it like a sniper rifle. Here we go. Here we go. Ooh, still quite far away. Well, let's try it. Try and take his leg out, perhaps. Let's go here. Or actually, let's go here. It's a decent chance to get a good hit in. Again, positioning matters, so let's fire and... Damn, really? That's too bad. That's too bad. Okay. Um, wondering where we should take cover next. Kind of maybe nailed ourselves a little bit. It's okay. Let's uh, end our action there. We're a little exposed. Not the end of the world. We'll be fine. We'll be fine. And we're actually able to fire this way as well. Pointless. I don't want to hit that. Let it bleed to death. We could move up to here, and that'll give us some shots into this melee crab. So let's try it. We'll be kind of far, but I'll see if it's worth firing. Need to keep ammo in mind as well. Again, you can run out of ammunition, which is terrifying. At least in the first build, it was terrifying. We got a fair bit of damage done. Could try to take out its leg again. Let's hope for the best. Come on, come on. Oh, really? Damn it. Knew I was wasting ammo. All right, nonetheless, end your actions there. So, what else have we got here? We've got evolving enemies. We've got... Uh, well, there's one cool thing that I'm hoping that I'll, I'll be able to show you rather than tell you about. Uh, evolving enemies, these randomly generated maps. Uh, interesting abilities on various characters. I'm kind of upset at that turret. Not getting any action in. What are you up to? Taking cover in here. The AI also seems to be pretty intelligent, for the most part. Sometimes it does some silly things, but some, for the most part, it's pretty smart. A little annoyed at this uh, turret. Not able to pick it up, am I? Hmm. What do we want to do here? Can you fire and actually get some damage in? No. Now, another interesting thing to know, I'm not 100% sure if there's friendly fire, but I'm not interested in finding out right now. But another interesting difference to know is that um, the firing, the shots that you take will actually push through to other targets. So for example, if I shoot at something and there's an enemy target behind, then I will actually hit the enemy target that is uh, behind as well. If I miss and you know the, the, the shot actually goes in. I hope I'm making sense. But basically, when you take a shot, the bullet is actually real. It exists, and it does damage based on where uh, where the bullet travels. Now, we're going to move you up here, and we're going to shoot into the back of this crab. And that should be the end of it. Oh, no, they were in Overwatch? No, no, no. We just found a new crate. Oh, it scared the crap out of me. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Hop over, hop off, and fire away. Really? Still not going to destroy it, eh? We can take a leg out. We're so close to taking the leg out. Let's go here. Come on now. Come on now. Work for me. Wow. It's crazy. <laughs> I was expecting some success there. Let's keep you in the cover here. We've got good cover. Let's move you up. Move you up to here. Should be able to destroy this thing from up here, I hope. And we'll have cover from this bad boy in here as well. There's one on the roof, I think, which I'm worried about. If he's got a gun, I don't think so. He looks like he's melee. Alright, come on now. We're definitely killing it. What a waste of ammo. Good stuff. Good clean hit. Keep you in cover over here. And over here. Ah, see, we have nothing to hit, unfortunately, with this. Alright, it's fine. Let's see, where do we where do we send you? I'm a little hesitant about exposing myself too far up ahead. This guy's up here as well. Alright, let's pull up to here. There we go. We need to move our sniper as well. Now this track that's coming on right now, hopefully you can hear it. I'm pretty sure, and I think they mentioned this in one of their dev vlogs as well, but I'm pretty sure that this is from... Oh, what's that game called? That space game. Uh, it's like pixel art. 
It'll come to me. It'll come to me. By the same guys I made Into the Breach. FTL, faster than light, that game. Yeah. Pretty sure that's what that little riff was from. All right. We're able to hit, potentially. Let's focus in here and hope for the best. Take this leg out, perhaps. Make it bleed. Fire away. God damn it. I need to move the sniper. I'm wasting shots here. Well, let's get you moving, buddy. Let's go. I only have so much ammo. I can't waste it all. All right. Alien turn. Damn it. Broke the cover. Took some damage. We're fine. We're not dead yet. We're returning fire as well. There's another little difference. Uh, some weapon, some equipment will actually allow you to return fire on the enemy. Uh, so if they shoot, then any of your uh, units or allies will be able to respond fire. What happened there? He just killed himself. <laughs> oh no. There we go. Returning fire again. So I guess he tried to shoot with a grenade launcher there. That's new in this build, if that was a grenade launcher. So he tried to fire and uh, took the floor out, as you can see, and dropped, took fall damage, and uh, is now bleeding out. And next turn should actually bleed out. Now, we've taken a touch of damage here, which I do not like. You got a grenade to throw. I was not expecting that at all. I was not expecting that at all. All right, how do we play this? How do we play this? Um, we've got this one up here, and there's one in there as well, which has a lot of health. I do have a grenade on this guy that I can throw. I'll try to take cover over here. Out of ammo, which I don't like. Or out of, uh, I mean, yeah, ammo. And I can try to throw this grenade over here. I hope to take the floor out. Let's move first. Let's move first for sure. Go over here where we have full cover. Not a bad idea. Okay, let's do this. Let's move up to here. Let's hope for the best. Go, 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 go. And grenade. Over here. I guess it'll bounce off. Well, only one way to find it. Oh, right, right. I don't have an angle. I see, I see. Well, I can throw the grenade over here, or we could try to move. Taking a huge risk if I do this. Well, anyone who's familiar with this channel is familiar with what I'm about to say. What is life without some risks? Let's go. Move you up here. Get the grenade in there. All right, let's do this. Come on now. All right, head, gun, arm disabled. Nice, that was a good hit. Uh, we do need to reload. Unfortunately, didn't actually break the ceiling. Uh, no, I don't know if I was actually expecting to, but uh, that worked out. Let's pop exertion. We'll give us some more action points so we can actually pull away and take cover. Uh, I say we take cover over here. Let's go. All right, good stuff. We'll hold there. And you, what do we want to do with you? This guy is bleeding. He's going to drop two hit points next turn. That's really not enough. This guy will die next turn. And you up there. I could finish you off, I think. Ah, don't really have the best angle, which is too bad. Could try and get a bit better angle on him, or I could just try and bolt it to here have to come down. Let's pull back to over here. Just in case he's got another grenade. Let's keep a safe distance between our uh, our units here. Our individuals, I should say. Alright, what do we want to do with you? Mm, yeah, here's what we're going to do with you. Move you here. Go, 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 go. Alright. And... All right, this is good. This is good. Hopefully we get this headshot in there. Lower it a bit. Okay, come on. Terrible camera angle. <laughs> Terrible camera angle. I should have just tossed a grenade instead. All right, fair enough. Now here's the other change. You can uh, use vehicles. We've got this bad boy over here that was added in the second build. This is very different from those XCOM games, for example. I don't recall them ever having vehicles, but I could be mistaken. But uh, in we go. Boom, we got a tank. Well, an APC to be specific, but we got a tank, baby. We got a tank. All right, let's keep moving. Uh, let's rush a little bit, I think. Need to make sure I don't keep myself exposed over here, but I also don't want to fall behind. If I pull here, I won't be able to shoot uh, shoot at anything. Don't really have the angles, so yeah, might as well get up over here. Get that full cover. Stay safe. Not going to reload just yet. All right. 
hold over there. And uh, yeah, so we have a we have a vehicle. We have a vehicle. It can shoot. It can ram, and it can have an inventory. Oh, okay, I see. It's got a turret, right? Well, I wasn't expecting that. Uh, sorry, like I said, this is my first time playing this build, so I'm ex I'm learning it as well. Uh, what do we do? What do we do? Uh, let's uh, let's go over to here. I'm trying to spot that red flashing light. All right, let's go over to here. Move. <laughs> Apparently, it destroys cover on its way as well. All right, and I guess we're just gonna gun this thing down. Feels a little wasteful. Feels a little wasteful. We only have so much ammo. Damn, I kind of wish I'd driven into this thing instead. You know what? Let's see how much damage we can cause with this bad boy. Move. <laughs> That's amazing. All right, let's close the gap here. Let's see. Do you have like a heavy gun or something to take me down? I hope not. I hope not. I could take cover or I could move in and try to ram that bad boy. All right, fine. Let's go this way. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Oh my god, poking holes. Destroying everything. This is going to come back to bite me, isn't it? Spot of that enemy as well. All right, let's hold over here. There we go. So the one that was bleeding out from before is now dead. Glad I left it. Alien activity time. Alien activity time. Oh dear, this is not good. This is going to hurt. Damn, that's a lot of hurt. We might actually lose this guy. I did not think about that. I did not think about that. I should have killed him. There's another one over here as well. This one's gonna pop shots at the APC. Yeah, we've got enough armor on this thing. I don't think I need to worry. All right, all right, this is not good. I'm bleeding over here. I will die next turn. Okay, here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna move you back first. Let's move you back here. <laughs> I like the little animations. It's a little cute. It's a little bit on the cute side, but I like it. All right, now we're going to fire into the back of this thing. Maybe a waste, but uh, we can't, can't let this thing live. Let's do that. No! Oh, no! <laughs> Oh no! Oh no! We killed one of our own! Damn! Damn, son, that does not feel good. <laughs> so there is friendly fire. There you go. Question answered. Now he's gonna bleed out. So that's good. Damn! Damn! Alright, let's move on up over here. And let's fire on you. Can we cause any... Oh no, you're way too far away to make this worth it. Way too far away. So instead, let's, uh, I guess, nudge you further. Let's get you over here. This guy's going to bleed out, so that's fine. Let's go. All right, stay put. But you're done. Oh, no, no, no. This is a uh, person inside. Could exit and open shots over here. I wonder if we'll have enough action points to do anything after it. Yeah, we will. Okay, cool. Cool, cool, cool. Try to hit you. You're bleeding two per turn. What are our actual chances here? Not very high. You we can kill. Or we can pull this way and open shots here. Unfortunately, that shield is up. And we won't be able to hit. All right, so in that case, I guess we could push up to... Ah, uh, we won't have any cover, though, is the problem. Maybe I should stay in the vehicle. Won't be able to get through, unfortunately. What if I throw a grenade over here? All right, we can try throwing a grenade. Hmm. I'm trying to figure this out. Trying to figure out the best way to approach this right now. move you to here. Let's hold you over there. See if we can't use that grenade next time. Over here. We're not able to get a clear shot, are we? 
Doesn't seem to be the case. Do I rush to here? This guy's gonna bleed out. This guy's going to be able to shoot. Yeah, let's rush to here. We're just wasting our sniper otherwise. Enemy spotted, but he's bleeding. Yeah, he's gonna die next turn for sure. Let's go. Go, 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 go. I can't believe I killed a fellow with friendly fire. Another one down. This one's gonna bleed a little bit as well. Deploying shield. Okay, you're gonna move up. You're gonna try to cut my APC here? No. Deploy shield in the wrong direction. Good stuff. Oh no. Okay, good. We're good. You know, you were supposed to die. You're supposed to die with that bleeding. As they bleed at the start of the. That sh yeah, that should have killed him. Not able to heal myself, am I? I am. I am. Okay, good stuff. Good stuff. Good stuff. Let's do that. Let's pull back to over here. This guy's gonna come in then. All right, let's see what we can do before we move him. Got you with the sniper rifle. Got you here. You should be able to kill him. Really, you can't. All right. We fire away. How much damage can we do here? We can get rid of the legs, I think, potentially. Let's try it. Let's try it. It's, we're going to have some shots returned, but it should be pretty inaccurate from all the way over there. My other option is to move somewhere where he can't see me. Like here. I don't know, it's taking the risk. Pull up to here. Now let's pull up to here. Let's be careful. Better safe than sorry, right? Alright, fire away. Now we won't get those shots fired back at us. And here we have access to this leg a lot more cleanly as well, so we might be able to cause more damage. We've actually got access to the head as well. You know what? Let's do this. Ah, but this is more definite damage. Fine, let's do this. Okay, good stuff. They start bleeding as well. Unfortunately, we couldn't kill it. But that's fine, that's fine. We have another shot in us, I guess. Yeah, I want him dead. Dead! Oh boy. Alright. We're okay, we're okay. Now you... You we pull which way? This way? Probably the safest. Let's see if we can't get rid of this guy first. If I fire with this... I'm wondering if instead I should fire with the pistol. Need to save ammo wherever possible, whenever possible. If I fire with the pistol... You'll definitely be dead, leaving nothing to chance. Getting a kill, too. Oh, what a boss! Steps out of cover and just BAM! Dead! Alright, beautiful. I love it. I love it. Let's get you... You still have another shot in you, actually. Not if we use a sniper. Mm. This guy over there. Am I able to actually take the inventory from out here? That'd be funny. He'll be able to shoot, but I think he'll be inaccurate enough. I don't. I can't take that risk, I think. I don't think I can take that risk. Well, if we go in with a pistol... Nah, I don't think it's worth it. I can nudge up to here to get a shot in. He's got his shield up. Which is a little concerning. Let's see, let's see what we can do. Yeah, no, this is pointless. That's kind of pointless. Let's not do that. Let's instead... Well, who else can we hit? Not you. You, We can't actually hit you. Let's just move in to... Uh, to here. Get that full cover. In fact, I could move in to here. And I could... Next turn, I'll be able to heal him. I don't know if I will, actually. All right, that's your turn. And over here, you've healed up. We could move you up to there. We could keep you hidden over here. I'm worried about this thing firing through this window. Let's move you up to here. No use staying hidden. All right, alien activity. Here we go. Oh, right, I forgot. He's lost his arm. And he's slowly dying away as well, so that's good. Ooh, damn. 
damn it. It's okay, just one damage. We'll hop into the APC again, and then we'll cause some trouble. How about that? How about that? All right, we've got one more charge left on this bad boy. Our gun is... Oh, we can't use it, can we? Because our arm is disabled. Damn. All right, well... Hmm. What are our options here? What are our options? This guy is slowly bleeding away. He still has a couple... He has still got some time left in his life. I could hop into the APC and destroy this guy's time. Ruin his day. I say we do that. Move in. Enter the vehicle. Yes, please. We'll use the vehicle first. Yeah, I think, I think we'll kill him. As long as we hit, we'll kill him. Hold on. Do we want to drive into him instead? So ram in a straight line in selected direction, de destroying or damaging everything in its path. How far do you go, though? How far do you go? I mean, this will definitely be entertaining to watch. Let's try it. We're trying to have fun here, right? Let's try it. What's life without some risks? <laughs> what? What? <laughs> we, like, flung him against the wall. That was awesome. I was not expecting that. That's dope. All right. I am... Thoroughly satisfied. Okay, over here. Let's move on up. Take some cover. Who do we have left? Just this one bad guy? Wish we had a count. Okay, and your action's there. And let's move you up this way as well. Again, I'm just gonna let this guy bleed out. I'm just gonna let this guy bleed out. Let's move up to here. So I can keep an eye on him. He doesn't pop up out of nowhere and surprise me. Let's, uh... And your action's there. And there we go. There's the big bad. Now, if you're not familiar with it, Build 1 had a queen as well. And the queen is terrifying. Look at this. Look at this thing. Well, hey, our turret can actually get some shots in now. Unless... Nope. <laughs> nope, no love for the turret. No love for the turret. Now, this queen is actually a newer version. It's using all the armored evolved parts. So like I mentioned, or at least like I hope I mentioned earlier, uh, the aliens evolve as you progress. They sort of evolve to your tactics. That's the plan, at least, as you go through the campaign. So this queen has all of her parts, as opposed to the first build where she has some fleshy bits. This queen has all of her parts covered by carapace. And so she's got a lot more armor from all angles. So you need to chip away at the armor first with armor piercing or armor shattering capabilities and then fire at her fleshy bits. And my God, she looks fantastic. Fantastic. Looking fine. Looking absolutely gorgeous. Look at that. Great model. And this is pre-alpha. I don't even know how complete that is. All right. So here's what we're going to do. We're going to try and destroy this queen. We do have a fantastic piece of equipment on this bad boy here. I need to take care of its legs. You saw how fast it can move. I need to drop its legs first. Um. Hmm. Wondering if we should jump somewhere safe. I don't really have clean jumps. And what's the radius on this thing? Or the range, rather, I should say. Uh, decent range. Decent range. Okay, that's good to know. It's good to know. We've got one baddie over here. Let's keep that in mind. Let's move you... Oh, man. This is going to be rough. Not looking forward to this. Okay, let's move you to here. Okay. And let's hold position. Actually, let's heal up. Let's heal up, get to full health. I know there's an extra there. We only had three damage, but I might as well do it now. End action. I've got the, uh, oh no, this is the dude within the vehicle. Am I stuck here? I guess I'm stuck here unless I ram out. Fair enough, that's funny. Uh... So yeah, let's ram out this way, make sure we don't stay stuck. And let's hope we don't actually hit our buddy there. I love the little animation, that's such a nice animation. Oh, so good! So far! Oh, I'm glad I'm glad I angled that correctly. So good, okay. Um, haven't taken any damage on this thing or anything. Pop out. What do we have? These little animations are great. I'm loving them. Alright, let's reload. We might as well right now. Alright, there we go. Boom. Full ammo here. Um, and... I don't think there's any point in being an Overwatch. 
don't have another turret. I could check this equipment crate and see if that's got anything for me, but uh, no, the queen's like right there. The queen's like right there, buddy. What are you thinking? Hop back into the vehicle. Go in. All right, now over here with the sniper, let's pull back as well. Uh, yeah, let's pull all the way back to here. I might not make this. I might not survive. I wouldn't be surprised. There we go. This guy's dead. So I think it's just the queen that's left. Here she comes. Oh my god, here she comes. Yo, that's not funny. I should just get everybody into the uh, APC. Um, hmm. Okay. You. Let's go. Oh, let's go, let's go, let's go. Now, I would be able to get a shot off with a rocket, actually. Nah, don't have a clean shot. Fair enough. So let's uh, hop into the vehicle. There we go. You can fit more than one. It is an APC. Wouldn't be a C. Wouldn't be an A without multiple spots. What about you? Let's pop you in here as well and run away. Might not be a terrible idea. All right, here we go. Oh, I, I, I have... I haven't the slightest clue if this is the way to go about this. Let's uh, let's get in the vehicle. Let's not take any chances and reload while we're right out here. All right, now you, vehicle. You. Where do we go? Where do we go? It's exposed its legs over here, so we could move here and fire into the legs, hopefully. Right? So let's move. Go, 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 go. It's a little cute. I don't mind it. It's a little cute. All right. Let's fire away. Let's try and take its legs out. So as you can see, if we take a leg out, it reduces move range by two, which is not bad. Not bad. Uh, and we also strip armor. Damn. All right, let's hit over here. We've got, like, the most chance to hit. Actually, over here, I think. So any stray shots hit the other leg. Come on. Oh my god, that's it. We're screwed, guys. We're screwed. We're screwed. I could leave. I could try and throw a grenade. I don't think this is gonna... I don't think I'm gonna make it. That'll use all of my action points. I will die. Nope. Back into the vehicle. That was a big mistake. And I hope she's not able to destroy this vehicle in one hit. Oh god. Well, there's another one? There's more of them coming? No way! How am I supposed to- oh, I'm not gonna make this. Here we go. Ten damage? Oh god, that APC is gonna be destroyed. Oh god, we're gonna be completely destroyed. We're screwed, boys. We're screwed. How do we, how do we play this? How do we play this? Fall back over here and keep firing away at its legs. Hmm. Do I try ramming it? Destroying damage everything in my path. That's a lot of legs. I should be getting all of the legs by doing this, right? Or am I just going to roll underneath it? We're about to find out together. Oh dear, this might be terrible. Let's do this. No, wait, it just blocked me? Well, that's cool. That's cool, thanks. I have no action points left. Oh my god, I'm screwed. I'm so very screwed. All right, here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna pop you out of the vehicle. We need to move. We're going to fire a rocket, if we can. We're gonna damage ourselves while we're at it. Pull you back to here. Oh, we're so screwed. Who's going to survive? I don't know faction points. We might as well run as far as we can. Uh, get you out of the vehicle as well. We'll keep you in the vehicle. Sniper. Get you out. Run you as far as possible. Go, 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 go. There we go. And... Right, our last guy's dead. 
Well, this is gonna suck. This is... Not gonna be good. Alright, I guess this is a little bit of a mistake. I need to pop out and then pop back in. Oh dear. Oh, hey! Almost some friendly fire there. Oh no, oh no, we're so screwed. Oh no, oh no. Don't hurt me! Back right wheel disabled. 12 damage, minus 3 armor. I need to get the hell out of here. Maybe she'll chase the vehicle. If I'm lucky, she'll chase the vehicle. Come on! Friendly fire! Come on, hit your own, hit your queen! Hit your queen! Okay, vehicle, let's go. Let's go. I guess I could run. And hope that she gives chase. That is an option. Because she'll close the gap, no problem. So yeah, let's run. Let's run. Go. Go, 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 go. Get away. Save yourself. Alright. Now we hope she gives chase. Yeah. Over here, we can pull you back. To where? What's your range on this thing? Pretty far? Pretty far. Alright. So we should be able to pull him back to like here all the way let's go let's go this way go here Gotta find the best place to put this guy so he can fire a missile all right and we'll just aim for the middle here and hope for the best maybe she's not armored underneath come on this shoulder mounted missile launcher oh yeah good hit Good hit. How much damage do we do? Right pincer disabled. We've got a little bit of hurt on all the legs as well. Can you pop out and throw your grenade? I don't think so. I don't think so. You can. Is it worth it though? Oh, I don't think so. I don't think we'll get enough damage into that leg. And we'll lose... We'll use both of our movements. Almost certainly not worth it. Almost certainly not worth it. Am I actually able to repair? I am. I am able to. I don't have the action points for it. All right, fair enough. So let's get back into the vehicle so, you know, we don't get <laughs> destroyed. And over here, let's pull you back. Oh, man. Is there any point in firing with the sniper? Oh, I mean, hey, we can do some decent damage to the legs here. Maybe. The head is also not gooey or fleshy. We might as well, right? We might as well. How far back can we go? Not very. Oh, no, no, no. We might want to actually rush in the opposite direction. split up and that way she has to follow somebody. She can't follow all of us. Someone must survive and cause the damage. Yes, I'm aware you're there. At least this time I'm aware you're there. All right, and actions. Where do you go? Where do you go? Where do you go? What do you do? She's bleeding, so she's taking some hurt. That's good. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. What have I done? I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. I'm glad I've got armor on that guy. Alright, that's fine. That's not gonna hurt me. We need to we need to take that queen out. Oh I got lucky there. I got so lucky. Okay. Um first things first, you pull you back here to fire we have to let's go let's go let's go let's go maybe draw some aggro if we're lucky all right Ooh. tempting but no no no. we need to work on its legs i think 
while we're barely able to get through its armor. It's insane. That's the most chance of damage we've got, I think. I like this, though. Let's do this. Yeah, this actually is not the most... Oh, no, it is. It is the most chance. But I need to slow it down. You can see how quickly it's moving. When you take all of its legs out, it slows down a lot. Oh, there's a torso. Okay, let's try this. Let's try this. Because I've got the missile as well. That will hopefully take out the legs. That did nothing. Front side disabled? What? With a pitiful little, pitiful little pistol? What are you doing to me, game? Oh, that did nothing. Buddy over here is gonna die. Alright, well, let's move. Go, try and stay alive. He's gonna come through and cut us in the chest or something. Oh, no, because we can't even fire now. Great. Alright, which way, which way, which way? Let's go here. Keep our distance from that guy. Uh, let's get out of the vehicle. I think now we're safe to stay out here. We can try and repair it next turn. I don't think the grenade will reach the queen, not from here. Yeah, 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 not a chance. So let's uh, fire at you. Maybe get some damage in, if we're lucky. Might as well, otherwise we're just sitting here doing nothing. Ah, yeah, I didn't think so. Didn't think so. And... Pop into Overwatch. I want to try and repair the APC. Yeah, here we go. This guy's gonna die. Head disabled, bleeding. Now the Queen's gonna turn around. Where are you gonna go? Towards the APC? Looks like it. Oh. Shots off on the Overwatch. Turning fire. Alright, good, good, good. I need to stay in that car now. I need to stay in that car. Oh my god. The fire the vehicle? Alright, we've got this. We've got this. I don't think we have this. We almost certainly don't have this. We don't have an angle. Action cost is 35%. Ooh, this is really causing a lot of lag. 35%. I won't be able to hit her. Damn it. I've used up all my charges in the med pack as well, so I can't heal myself. I think this is the best we can hope for here. Try and keep myself alive, but this guy's going to keep chasing me down, and I'd rather get at least one more shot in. 35% is a lot. If we go here, we'll be able to get a missile shot. It's the best we can hope for, I think. Come on, baby. Come on. Work for me. Well, we caused some damage, so there's that. nowhere near enough. Now, do we really want to repair? Do we want to throw the grenade? Throw the grenade. I don't think we'll ever get a chance like this again. Throw the grenade. Nice. Oh boy. Alright, we're okay. Oh, we still not disabled anything on this thing. Um. Yeah, let's hop in. This vehicle is going to be the thing that makes it or breaks it for us. Pull back to here. What's taking damage here? Everything on this side. And that pincer. Okay, let's pull back to here. Go, go, go. Turn around and fire and hope for the best. We're like drawing this out as much as possible. Alright, what can we actually destroy here? Get some good shots right in that meaty bit over there. That'll be good. Alternatively, I can still work away at trying to slow her down, but I don't know if that's worth it. Honestly, if that first um, 
if that first move hadn't been blocked, we would be so much further ahead. Where's that meaty bit? There it is. Let's try it. Go. Come on. Oh, come on. Really? She turned around the last minute. It caused some damage. Minus five from that. Okay, good thing she's bleeding. He's gonna fire away. Oh my god, we have no cover. And he's taking damage. Nice. See, that's what I mean. Friendly fire. Ballistics actually go through. Yeah, this guy's dead. Oh my god, he like backhanded him to nowhere. Oh dear god. No! <laughs> oh my god, that's what I mean. These games are punishing. They gave them an impossible task, and they did what they could. May they rest in peace. Prepare a defensive perimeter. It's only a matter of time before we're overrun. Let's go down like soldiers. Dear lord, that was insane. Again, first time playing this build. I'm sure I'll, uh, I'll be able to overcome it eventually. We'll find out. Let me know if you guys want to see more of Phoenix Point with a comment down below. If you enjoyed this video, make sure you hit that like button. And if you'd like to stay up to date with Phoenix Point and other strategy games, again, that's sort of my focus here, uh, mainly focusing on strategy games of all kinds, a little bit of RPGing as well, because I do like that RP stuff. So make sure you subscribe if you are interested in that and keeping up to date with everything that's coming out in these genres. I can't... Oh, man. I feel like I had a chance there if I didn't mess up that la that 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 run that ram at the beginning with the the APC. Well, that's life for you. Thank you all very much for watching. A massive thanks as well to all of my patrons who provide support to this channel on a monthly basis. It makes such a big difference. I can't even begin to express. Till next time, when we'll hopefully do better. Cheers.